you definitely want to try this vegetable stir fry i got here my breast chicken you can use any protein of your choice and i am adding my spices paprika gingerbread garlic and onion powder black pepper and i give it a good mist in my pan i'm adding my olive oil so i'm going to deep fry this chicken i'll fry it until it turns golden brown you can fry it to the level you want it's still all good to go and i got here my broccoli it's really fresh i'm gonna go on and cut them into pieces and, and soak it in hot water and uh, salt while it's being soaked i set it aside and go back to check on my chicken so i continue stirring it to make sure it's well fried and it's almost get ready at this point yeah this is okay for me so i set it aside and go back to use the same oil to fry my onion garlic and onion mm -hmm. cut into pieces and i'm adding it to the onion so i continue to continue to stay and let it caramelized so i add my my carrot red bell pepper continue to mist and i add my green bell pepper continue to mist and i add my yellow bell pepper still continue to mist so i add my turnips and continue to stir to make sure everything is completely mixed up and i add my celery my cochet and give it a very good mist mix up everything and let it continue to fry in low heat i add most of the vegetables i have you can add more here i'm adding my broccoli continue to give it a good mist you can add whichever vegetables you have even if you have more you can add it this is all about vegetables this is the fried vegetables so you can add eggplant or more vegetables it's all good so yeah mixing up everything mixed mix mix and i'm adding my fried chicken and i'll continue to mix it very well mixed 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 guys you can see everything is coming together and it's all looking delicious yeah it's all coming together so i add my no cube and continue to stir yeah this is very easy to make it's not that complicated you just have your vegetables and there you are Look at how delicious, colorful this is looking. So I let it continue to cook in a low heat. I'm adding my celery here and continue to mix. At this point, I'm gonna give it my last mix. Then I add my corn, maize. Like I said, you can use any amount of vegetables you want. So I'm using my soy soy adding my soil sauce yeah and continue to stir it so i'm adding this papillot uh, uh, onion yeah this papillot is give it a good taste then i'm going to add this uh, curry indian uh, curry powder and continue to give it a good mist at this point everywhere is smelling so good so yeah, I am adding cornstarch. I'm gonna add some water into this cornstarch and mix it, make sure everything is mixed. Mixed, 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 then I add it to my uh, vegetables. So this is for thickening. You can add more if you, you're not okay with the consistency you, you get, but I am okay with my consistency. So you can add the uh, milk too okay for if it's too thick you add a bit of milk and uh, yeah so this is a little bit uh, thick for me i'm gonna go on and add coconut milk yeah because i want to loosen the thickness a little bit that way it will have 
a little bit of sauce it will have more sauce here so this is the final um, stage of this meal this sauce and everything is all looking good yeah you can see it's very tasty if you still want more liquid you can add milk or you add water whatever your disposal you have you can add it and guys i am having this with rice you can have this with uh, pasta with potato chips um puree whatever you have it's all good to go it's all blend so well so guys i hope you enjoy this video you see how appetizing this is looking so yummy i hope you really like it and you enjoy watching it please don't forget to give me a like comment below what recept you want to you want me to try and thank you so much for watching and i will see you again in my next video bye